Ladies and gentlemen, coming at you this Saturday, May 13th, at the Indian Head Center for the Arts, Black Box Theater, none other than your boy, Rolling Bubba Grimes, Rolling Grimes Show Live on stage, 4 o'clock p.m., Saturday, May 13th. And with me, I have my good friend and band leader for this special event, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Greg Boyer. Greg, man, look, you played at the Black Box Theater not too long ago. Tell us about that experience, man. Well, it's good to return home. You know, all the roads lead to home, and all the stuff I did led me right back to Indian Head that particular night. And the love, the atmosphere was beyond description, along with a few other little backstories that went on that night uh, with some guys I went to school with and, and it was just a great night to play music and, and be back and just show everybody how proud I am to be from where I am. That place was very intimate. It was a hundred people but they were right up on you. And you play a big arena with the lights and everything being what they are. You can only see past the first ten rows. Everything past that is a shadow. So it's very different playing in an intimate setting such as Black Box Theater, and I really love it because I feel like I'm playing for everybody in the room as opposed to being just a job where I'm performing. And the great part about it is everybody in the theater can hear and see real well. Yeah. So they're right up on you because we are right up on you. Right up on you, and I knew everybody in there, almost anyway, but you know, a lot of those people I hadn't seen in 20, 30, 40 years, and it was good to bring it all back home. I really felt like that night was special for me and I I would venture to say everybody in attendance. Saturday, May 13th, 4 o'clock p.m. Greg Boyer is going to accompany Roland Grimes' show on stage. Greg Boyer actually was part of the very first set of the Roland Grimes show live. Uh, it It was at a dinner theater. In Upper Marlboro, Greg doesn't remember. <laughs> yeah, I remember, man. Uh, we had a great time. I was a, a nervous wreck not having done that kind of thing before. You know, my thing is playing trombone. So to go in there and speak about topics, but man, know, all we- I had to do was just speak my mind and put it all out there and, and not worry about being wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about that experience, man. When you walked away from it, how'd you feel? I felt like... I could do this, but I also felt like I need to learn a little bit more about this particular uh, idiom of entertainment and information. And one of the things you can't go in there is not having done your work. Yeah, you're here. 